Hi everybody, what's going on? How's everyone doing today? We're in Boardman, Ohio at St. Mary's Catholic Church and we're assuming that it's closed and abandoned or for sale because here's a sign right in front of it. And we're only assuming that it's closed. Um, we went back in the parking lot and it looks like it's not in good condition. Like there's grass and stuff and weeds growing back there and in the actual parking lot. So I'm going to pause this and we'll get closer to the church and we'll take a look around. All right. Now we're only assuming that it's closed and, and abandoned. <laughs> I'm with my husband, Terry Allen Channel. <laughs> this is right next to the Boardman Library, which is over there. It's a long walk up that uh, drive, long driveway. <laughs> Borman High School right across the street. The school I went to and graduated from. Borman High. Go Spartans. <laughs> Go Spartans. Oh, you can't see too good in there. We found some windows in the back where you can see a little better inside. <laughs> Terry's car. <laughs> Here's a window. Uh, kind of dark. Employees only. I don't know if you can see too good from here, but all throughout the parking lot there's grass and stuff growing everywhere and weeds in the actual cracks of the parking lot. I'll show you that in a minute. None of these vents and fans are blowing or working either. And inside here there's a sign. St. Mary's Banquet Center award winning catering graduations, weddings, and it says 2012 and 13. But I looked in their mailbox earlier, which is over here, right over here. They had mail in there from August, July and August of 2019, and it's now September. So somebody's still coming in here getting the mail, cutting the grass, kind of taking care of the place. Terry tried calling his phone number to see if this place is still in business, but there's no answer. And this is part of the banquet. Um, you could see some chairs and tables in there. I'm trying to focus as best as I can for you guys. And that's a little too dirty. Uh, let's see. I know it's dark, I'm sorry guys, I'm trying. <laughs> I 
but there's chairs and tables in there. This was the banquet hall part of the church. Look how faded out these are from the sun. All the welcome signs are out here. And you can kind of see weeds and stuff growing throughout the parking lot. And it's everywhere throughout the whole parking lot. So, we tried these doors, but no luck. <laughs> it's inside of the church. Off to the right is um, part of the banquet center. Yeah. <laughs> they keep it locked. And there's a fire extinguisher right inside there, Let's see if I can focus, that the dates are 2017, 2018, and 2019. If you can see it, there it is. So, we're kind of like, <laughs> not sure, but it's kind of obvious. I mean, it might have just recently closed, but Maybe they just don't take care of it that well. And here's um, another part of the church. It's pretty cool how they have the glass here. I like that design. There's a little peephole. <laughs> and there's their mailbox I was talking about. I looked in here earlier. And there's some dates on the newspapers that actually say July and August of this year. So we had to pause it. There was a policeman that came over here, but he's just kind of hanging out, doing his paperwork and stuff, so he's really cool. But anyways, I, f I forgot to show you guys this, how cool it is. I like how the wood carving is up there. Yeah, Terry said he saw a cop come, come over here. And uh, we, we paused our videos and went over and talked to him. To let them know that we're not here to destroy anything. That we just assumed it was closed and abandoned because of the sign out there. And um, that we're YouTubers. And that we're just um, taking pictures and stuff and doing stuff for YouTube. So he was really cool though. He's like, you're fine. I'm just, I'm just here using my computer and stuff and doing some kind of paperwork. I think is what he told Terry. So, <laughs> is that a piece of bread over there? Wait, what is that? Uh, yeah, aww. Somebody must have been feeding the, aw, the birds and ducks around here. This is a big parking lot. It goes all the way back here. Plus, all the way over, all this over here. It's a big parking lot. Yeah, policeman, he uh, seemed very nice. Yeah, because we've been kind of hanging around this church. We, we actually, we checked it out first. We took pictures first of different stuff around this church, the building, and Terry actually made some phone calls to see if this place was still open. So we um, were under the impression that somebody called the Boardman police 
and that maybe he was coming to check things out because people probably saw us walking around because there's a house right next to the church there's a school across the street and uh, the Borman Library so can you see in there oh it's kind of dark yeah we can't it's dark sorry guys Ooh, look at that spider web but he was a nice cop though he didn't get mad and we told him what we were doing here, so. I took some pictures of all this earlier, too. Like, they had this covered up, and there's um, some kind of plants growing in there. Huh. It looks like some type of ivy, but I'm not sure. What if this place isn't abandoned and we just think it is? <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Look at that plant growing in the... In the cement. <laughs> oh, it looks like a white poopy turd. Poopy turd. <laughs> oh, what do we got? I took pictures of this too, this vent. York High Efficiency. <laughs> so, I think somebody still comes around here and cuts the grass. And it might have just recently uh, went up for sale, recently closed. So I'm really not sure, guys. I'm really digging this area, though, because we came back here and took pictures earlier. And so that's a, like a hallway inside there. And then they have some um, wood steps over here. And I'm assuming that they put plants out here, like, like that one. I bet it looked really pretty if they had like a bunch of plants over here and you walk by in the hallway. I'm like, I really like this, Terry. It's nice. <laughs> Can't see in there. It's inside this hallway. Can't really see too much in there, but... And, uh, this is a screen door, so maybe they would come out here and take care of, uh, the garden and the flowers and stuff. I'm sure that's probably what they did. But it's really nice. It's really pretty. And there's some stained glass up there. Sorry about the sunlight. It's really bright today. So I'm going to close this. Wait, hold on guys, let me pause it. Okay. There we go. Look how pretty that is. It's a nice day today. Not quite fall yet, but we still have some nice summer days. I took some pictures of these earlier. I'll post them on my Instagram. Sorry if I'm going too fast, going up and down like that. <laughs> oh, there's the policeman, yeah. He's up there. He actually moved up. He was back closer to the... He was back clo closer back here to the church. But let's get a shot of this. Isn't that nice? That's a big cross, huh? Alright guys, I'm going to wrap this video up. Let me turn this around real quick. Hey guys, here we go. Can you see me? <laughs> Thanks for watching us. We appreciate all the feedback, all the likes, all the comments. Let us know what you think about this place. Um, we assume that it's been closed. We don't know how long, but somebody obviously comes here and 
cuts the grass and gets the mail once in a while, but all right. Um, give us a like, a share, a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. We would really appreciate it. Last night I, I was at 130 subscribers. I really appreciate that. Um, want to give out a shout out to, huh, I'm out of breath because it's so humid, but um, I want to give a shout out to Richard Wolf, Kara Wolf, Wally B26, um, a bunch of other YouTubers that we've done collabs with, Manny Quackia, um, Griffin, which is GRM Adventures, and um, the Muncie channel. Check all those guys out. Woo. Huh. It's getting a little bit hot and humid, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. I just went to my doctor's appointment this morning. And um, they're actually going to switch my um, anxiety medicine. So we'll see if that helps me a little bit better. Alright guys. Um, thank you very much. Peace out. Take care and we'll see you in the next one.